rate and your base payment. Just want to let you know you can take delivery of your vehicle at that payment with approved credit. Based on some of your information you share with me, that may not be the best choice for you. There are, there may be some few better options for you, and it's my responsibility to go over them with you. May I begin? Sure. Fantastic. The first option, which is our preferred, or by choosing the preferred option, you receive a six-year, 75,000-mile service contract, <coughs> which covers everything with the exclusion of fit and finish trim, excess wear and, or, yeah, excess wear and tear, tires, belts and hoses, keys. $100 deductible. It's good nationwide. Moving over to the gap insurance. Are you familiar with what gap is? I'm not. Okay, well, gap insurance just covers the difference between a total loss of a vehicle, God forbid the car is stolen and not recovered, or in an accident and it's totaled, covers the difference between what you still owe with the bank and how much it's valued at, and also covers you up to a $1,000 deductible. Now, the next one is our road hazard, and it's uh, basically in the event that, say, you're driving down the street, and you hit a pothole below your tire or rim, it's covered under zero dollars, good nationwide. You're also receiving debt and ding protection, which protects your exterior of the car up to four inches as long as there's no paint damage. You're also getting windshield protection, which repairs any windshields that have chips in them. Moving down to our maintenance plan, that one gives you your second and your third year maintenance prepaid. So what that means, well, yeah, prepaid maintenance. Over here is our key protection. And with key for five years, you're receiving key protection. So if you lose any keys, Keychains, or excuse me, keys, programming the remote, cut or cut and programming the keys or any keys on the keychains for place for five years. Moving over to our theft protection, it gives you a warranted benefit of up to $2,500. God forbid the vehicle was stolen and not recovered within 30 days. Moving over to our safe shield, uh, basically it's our exterior protection of the vehicle. Also protects against um, inside stains as long as it's not corrosive. And on the outside, it protects against acid rain, bird droppings, industrial fallout. Payment options are here and here. If you have any questions on the preferred option before I move over to the value option? No. Fantastic. So with the value option, you're receiving identical coverage as your preferred. However, what you're forfeiting is going to be the safe shield. So imagine you drive down to the beach, you park your car under a lamppost, Car's there for the whole week. You haven't been back to it because you've been walking up to the beach because you're so close. Say you parked under some birds. Birds ended up pooping on the car, baking the sun. Poop just ain't through the clear coat. So now you have a few options. You can either get that repair at that time, which is going to cost you a couple thousand dollars to even match the clear coat of the paint and repaint the whole vehicle. Or when you go to turn in the vehicle, you're going to lose out some money when you go to turn it in. My used car manager takes a look at it because there's some blotchy spots on it. Payment options are here and here. Moving over to our basic option, you're receiving identical coverage as the value. However, you're forfeiting the theft protection. So imagine you are at the movie theater with Piper. Uh, you're enjoying a nice kid's movie. You come out, bam, car is gone. Piper's stuff is all gone. So what ends up happening now, you call your insurance company. Car is not found for 30 days. With the theft protection, they give you a warranted benefit of $2,500. That can go towards your next vehicle. The payment options are here and here. And moving over to our economy option, you're receiving identical coverage as the basic, however, you're forfeiting the key protection. So, <clears throat> imagine you want to start the car up for Shannon in the morning, go to run in, in between juggling Piper, the kids, and Shannon, you end up dropping the key. The key falls into the gutter, can't even find it anymore, you're lost. What ends up happening there is you can either go to the dealership, get us to recut and program a key for you, and that's going to cost about $350 to $400 out of pocket for you. Now payment options are here and here. Do you have any questions on any of the options, Danielle, before I ask you to choose one? Uh, I don't think so. Fantastic. Please pick the option that works best for you. Um, do I have to pick one? Yes. Uh, I think I just want to stay with the, the base payment. You know, I'm on a budget, so. Okay, I understand. If you just want, you can just, uh, initial right next to the base payment line up there. Fantastic. All right, Danielle, I've been doing this for a while now, and usually when customers tell me that they want to choose or select the base payment, it's one of two reasons, either the way that they were grouped or the cost. May I ask which one it was in your case? I guess the cost. Okay, no problem. I understand that cost is an issue. I'm a consumer outside of here as well. But let me ask you something, Danielle. Out of the preferred package, which two options do you see the most value in? Um... I guess the the maintenance plan 
and the, um, the gap insurance. Yeah, fantastic. Most of my customers choose the same one. What's nice about Hamilton Volkswagen is we can cater the options to fit your needs and want specifically. So you said the theft protection and the gap protection? No. What? I'm sorry. I said the maintenance and <laughs> the, the gap protection. and the gap protection. Fantastic. So maintenance is 375 gap protection is 1075 Combined, you're looking at 1450 Please circle the one that works best for you and your family. Uh, circle. Fantastic.